Hi, I'm Luke. Today on Out of Darts, I wanted to show off a new product in a new series. I am working on a lot of PCBs, that, that means printed circuit boards. And this is a high-powered MOSFET board intended for flywheel blasters. A MOSFET is a type of transistor that allows switching a very high current using very low current switching wire. And what that means practically in a Nerf blaster is that you can replace this instead of adding a replacement switch. So you can keep your stock switches if you like, or you can upgrade them if you really like that nice clicky feel. But in any single flywheel blaster where you've got just a, a single circuit, this is a perfect fit. Now, it's very, very simple to wire up. You simply wire your motor motors to the plus and minus, and you wire your battery to the plus and minus where they are labeled as battery and motors plus minus. After that, you've got two jumper cables that are included. You One is labeled rev and fire, and the other is power. They are effectively the same, however, but you plug these uh, jumpers in, and you can wire these directly to your an on-off switch and to the rev or fire, which is, of course, your switch or uh, your, your rev switch on your blaster. Now, this I recently did a video for the Hera, and it makes modding the Hera so, so easy. And on other blasters like, say, the Demolisher, this makes fitting the wire a lot easier where you don't have as much room for high current wire. And again, you just, very, very simple to wire up. There's almost nothing to this. This can exist anywhere inside your blaster you want. Generally, you want to have as short of a connection between the flywheel motors and the P PCB the, and the MOSFET here itself, so don't make it any longer than you need to, but, but overall, this just makes wiring these up ridiculously easy. If you've done a MOSFET before, you know that it can be quite a pain to actually wire in the resistors and the diode, and it's a lot of finicky little work, and then even when you've done that, you don't have the heat dissipation properly uh, maintained. With a printed circuit board like this, the entire circuit board acts to dissipate heat, so it really will help with the current. Now this is the high-powered board, so this board is capable of six flywheels, so it is perfect for a dominator where you're going to have three sets of flywheels, and it can handle just a single set, so it's pretty versatile in that it can work with everything. So that's basically it for the high-powered board. There will be a lot more coming in this series of products. I am working with an engineer friend who has been really helpful in educating me and um, helping do the design work on these and uh, fulfill the needs. I will be doing another video kind of asking what else you'd like to see in this realm after I've released the next few products. Now if you're looking for something for a full auto system like a rapid strike or a strife with an auto pusher or say a nemesis, chaos, I would recommend waiting because I will have a product out that has two channels with motor braking so that you can do this same kind of wiring but with a full auto. Lots more to come. I hope you like the new product. Tons of links in the description and more information as well as link to the Hera guide where I actually wire one of these up. It's The wiring used in that Hera guide is pretty much perfect for any single circuit system. So do check that out. Thanks for watching. Until next time, I'm out of darts.